Hey, what's up guys? Thanks for tuning in. So this might be a little bit of a ranty type video, so I apologize in advance, but I think I'm going to be leaving Ubuntu for a while. I'm a little irritated of the snap mania, snap apocalypse going on where absolutely everything is a snap. I know for security wise and everything, it's good for the development. It's good. But you know what? When I look at my system resources and I have a lot of partitions, I have a lot of different drives that I do stuff on. And when I switch over to file systems, I see all this crap. They, for some reason, didn't filter all this out. Like, why do I have to see all of this? Everything is a filter. The calculator is a filter, or not a filter, sorry. Everything's a snap. The calculator is a snap. Log files are a snap. This, this system monitor is a snap. Everything is a snap. Why? And I mean, when I'm in the terminal even and doing some like manual mounting stuff and whatnot, it's all here too. So, you know, this crap is just pissing me off and I don't like how they're changing everything over to snaps, make it their own thing. And it's kind of, I feel it's distancing themselves from being a distro like every other distro. They're trying to make their own little packages that run their own way. Like, yes, I know for the server stuff, it's awesome, but for 18.04 for desktop users, this, you don't need this. And, you know, at least have a little checkbox here or something that says, you know, hide all these loops. I don't want to see this crap. Um, it's really annoying when I come in and I just want to quickly see my partitions and how much space is available on them. And it's like this giant list of just junk. So anyways, uh, I was supposed to, let me just fire this up here. I was supposed to review OpenSUSE Leap 15, which came out on Friday. And I was supposed to be away this weekend. Plans didn't really work out. Other important things came up and I was a little distracted, but I did install it yesterday onto my system and I like it. It worked. I had to do the ACPI thing that I showed you in the, I'll link it up here, what to do after installing Linux. And it was the, the, the boot issues. You had to put in some ACPI stuff into the kernel parameters. I had to do that to get the ISO to boot up because it was free. It was freezing on the hardware detection. So I did that and it got in and it installed no problem. Everything works perfect. I haven't done the NVIDIA drivers yet, but I will. And, and then after that, I'm going to do a review on it and I'm going to install Manjaro as well. I downloaded the latest ISO for that. And then I'm going to have to decide if I want to switch to using OpenSUSE or switch to Manjaro. I'm going to keep Ubuntu 18.04 to keep developing Scion Linux, which is still on the back burner, but the interest in Scion isn't really there. So I haven't really been motivated to, you know, push it out right away. And so I was like, I'll polish it and whatever. Um, but I'm going to keep 18.04 on my system so I can keep working on that, but I'm going to switch my main distro. So I'm going to install OBS, which I use to record this stuff. I'm going to set up the microphone, noise cancellation, all that stuff on the other two distros. And then, and then we'll see which one I pick. And I really don't know which one I will pick. So my question to you guys is, do you use Ubuntu? Are you using 18.04? And what would you guys do? And are you, are you guys going to keep using it? Does this even bother you what I'm ranting about with this? the stuff. I mean, maybe, maybe you guys don't care. You don't look at this stuff. Um, and should I switch to Manjaro or OpenSUSE? Because I, I like both, but at the same time, I kind of have a love hate relationship with both because they've both messed up at some point. And, you know, my graphics died, my Wi-Fi died, like both of them had issues. 
And so I'm going to run them both up. I'm going to install all my usual software on both. And then from there, I'll decide. But what do you guys think I should stick with? Should I stick with the OpenSUSE? Should I go with Manjaro? I don't know. So I'm reaching out to you guys. And do you guys use it? And why do you use it? Um, do you use Ubuntu? Why do you use Ubuntu? I mean, I know why I use it and I've always liked it, but now it's getting to the point where this snap mania stuff is just stupid and it's just pissing me off at this point. So let me know in the comments below, what are you using? What should I use? What do you think? Help me make my decision. And uh, yeah, sorry for the rant video. I don't like doing these rant things, but you know what? It's just, it's ticking me off. I'm, I'm going through trying to install new software and it's a snap. That's a snap. Everything is a snap. So yeah, I'm getting irritated. But anyways, if you want to hear about more of my rants, you'll find some more over on my Twitter at Dorian.slash. And you can also find over there what's going on with me because I've got a busy summer coming up. So I'll try to pump out as many videos as I can. But if I'm away, I'm going on a trip, or whatever, you might not hear from me. So Follow me on Twitter and you'll know why. All right, guys, that's it for now. Till next time, bash on.